surprised if they go back to the particular marksman. But we're going to find out right now. It's going to be the Claw and Lolita for the Philippine teams. Yeah, this is great setup as well. The Lolita just synchronized with the Esmeralda very well. Cloud, Sunspark's comfort pick here. We, we saw, uh, I believe it was uh, JP on the Cloud before, but it's taking a little bit too long to come online. But hopefully, they will be able to drag this out because right now, Burmese goals, they have the early aggression. And will Sunspark be able to hell on to here because it's all hands on QVJ on the Esmeralda to carry the team here for the Filipino teams the Philippine teams yeah the prodigy of Philippines but Hayabusa for Burmese goals we've seen yesterday our RQ sin on the Hayabusa was just a was literally a shadow came in like a shadow assassinate the rest uh, the rest of Burmese goals I believe uh, sorry the rest of Todak and managing to take those wins away for our RQ and Burmese goals they saw that I like this type of pick. Good against Klaus. Picks, but there we go. Final game of the series is either Philippines or Myanmar. Ladies and gentlemen, Sunspark, Burmese goals. Game number three right now. Who's gonna come on top here? We have Sunspark on the blue side and we have Burmese goal on the red side here. Middle side here, a little bit of a trade off here. Nothing too shabby here or big yet. However, Burmese goals, they're gonna be contesting the blue buffs of uh, Sunspark on the bottom side of the jungle. Yeah, remember we talked about how the little things do add up. Maybe getting killed off for Sunspark's first blood in the second game. They stole out this card as effective, and now he's gonna lose that flicker. And Sunspark immediately collapse. They get the stun. First blood for Fuzakin. And the revitalized commitment from Sunspark as well to safely disengage. As of now, Burmese goes. They have to punish QBJ and losing maybe right off the bat is not exactly a great plan here but Sunspark they capitalize on that kill here this is gonna buy them a little bit of time to work with here but 3.6k net worth right now only a 300 deficit here and Sunspark they're gonna make sure JP comes up online but let's take a look at the replay from that fight and again maybe just caught out it should not have happened the idea was correct. Wanna go for those invade and now Burmese goes they want to look for an answer on to Renzio but Renzio doesn't have the Firaga armor does Able to get out, so no, nothing for Burmese goals to get. Fuzakin also survives. Yeah, my oh my, Sunspark as of now, one, one here. But you can see mass recalls being popped up here to reset this fight for that turtle buff. Look at this, eight seconds up on the turtle buff here. QVJ turtle is walking his way soon. through here. They want to contest the turtle buff. The rest of the teams from side Burmese goals are also going to be focus heading towards the th northern section of the map the top side of the map here to deal with that turtle buff and panda is nowhere close to the four yet he needs a penalty zone in that stack team fight as well and you can see sunspot he's just zoning his way making sure that he doesn't clear this creep wave in time to go for it the reinforcements for the turtle buff but now well they lose Wizard he went in for the check and he will get punished for that 8007 5 kill video kill video with the falling stun one has to get out Burmese goes can they secure this turtle yes they will retribution for Harry will make sure that happens and the glorious pathway right on top of Sunspark Burmese goes lays out the big carpet the Numino Blast actually doesn't connect doesn't come through for Sunspark and Burmese goes will punish them JP the next to go Lazy Dwayne keeps him alive the wild child of Wizard Kid 001 still alive Zamas wants Chrono Dash he gets out for the flick of a kill BJ he actually goes to the other side of the wall falling stun from Burmese he gets the kill on the Harry, but now four members of Burmese go on top of it. The crop comes in, the crop gets one though. The Felicia, no more damage from Sunspark. Equal trade, two for two. Yes, my oh my. Not to mention as well, the Luminum Blast from the Felicia. His most cancelled by Baby's Divine Judgment. If not, things would have went south for Burmese goals, but still, great re engagement here from Sai Sunspark. They dragged this fight long enough for QVJ to reset his health and come in back with the falling star moon from the side of QVJ. Yeah, slight unfortunate. A situation right there that killed VJ. Met, uh, he flickered this on the other side of the Guardian Barrier. If not, Kid 001 would have fallen earlier. But nonetheless, great trade from both teams. They responded uh, uh, accordingly to what each other wants to yeah, do. Yeah, nicely done from Rosie's teams here. But like I said as well, the first turtle ball being secured from the cell. It was a pretty all out fight coming from both these teams. But Burmese schools came up top right now in terms of the economy just because the Harris can do way much more with compared to Esmeralda without a buff. So in this case, they need to secure the buffs once again before the next fight. 8007, Hayabusa, we might be a split push here coming from Burmese Goose, which is the initial intention that they want to do right now. And Burmese Goose, four members looking for Renzio. 
Renzo a big call out by the Law and Order. They will go for the collapse. Renzo, Fraga Armor will be popped instantly. Last Sandy cancel the Divine Judgment. Fuzzle Kid is in. Zama from a kid 001. This guy is fearless, but kill BJ will punish him. And Burmese go over step. Then go Lumino Blast on top of three. Sunspark now re engaged. Wants to go for the fight, but Burmese goes managed to disengage from that. Wow, what a save there from Sunspark. They go for it for the base. Burmese goes with the saves as well. And Panda going for the swing here. They want to come in this fight. Sunspark, they're going for the swing. But a huge swing there. Hayabusa with a shadow kill. They will take the low leads. Up. But Sunspark will retaliate and trade one for the feature as well. But blows after blows, this is by far as close as it gets. We're down towards game number three. We talked about this here. 50 50 for blows, it seems all the way through, and it is happening right here, right now, Husky. But one of the facts we overlooked in that previous fight Sunspark, they were fighting four versus five. Claw was left alone in the top lane to farm up to get their first tier turret. So, right side for Sunspark, the Cloud had his free space. JP still clean 0 0 and 2. Burmese goes, they get that turtle, Sunspark looking for another fight, the Nomino Blast only landing on the Hydro though, Ice Ice getting engaged on Fuzukan with the power of nature, not able to do enough damage, they block him back. Oh, as of now, gonna be taking a chill pill here, because as of now, they're waiting for the right moment here, but Burmese goes, they're looking for that right moment here, but the tier 1 is still up here for both these teams, both teams do not want to make any sort of mistakes here, Sunspark, you can see, they're taking a chill pill, just because Burmese goes have the network advantage and QBJ he only recently just got his Calamity Reaper and this is where QBJ is gonna hit like a truck but Burmese goes will they fall prey who's again sees maybe Divine Judgment available they can pull it forces the wall charge tries to go for this engagement here but maybe will look for a different target here and it seems to be Burmese goes they're looking to take the tier 1 how will they do this? what a wild charge to make sure that maybe doesn't drag him back with the Divine Judgment Sunspark Man, I need to defend that first tier tower, and that is good news for the Pillow Twitter team. Remis goes. They have invested resources, but Sunspark still has to be careful because maybe has that ultimate online. Yes, my oh my, but immortality up on Renzio here. This is where Renzio can get a little bit more aggressive in the next team fight to come here. But it seems to be both teams respecting each other's territory. They're gonna be waiting for the next turtle bomb before committing this fight. A007 once again trying to go for the uh, pushes here, but it's not gonna happen Ooh. here because for the middle side, they catch up Fuzz again, they catch up QBJ. So Burmese goes, they're looking to close out this game and now they have the advantage, they will take two, they will try to get more and Sunspark, they do not have the Aphrodite in the pool. Renzio trying to go for the defense here. Can they buy enough time for Fools again and QBJ to reset this right now? And this is just a, a mistake from Sunspark. Burmese goes, they were toying around with Sunspark. They saw the Luminum Blast used, uh, wasted to no avail and they immediately collapsed on Sunspark. Two members in the bottom lane for the Philippine team, Burmese goes. They had four and they punished Sunspark for that. They will get that third turtle. Because of this third turtle here as well, the map is pretty much open. Burmese goes is looking to stop out Sunspark. They have to find a way to split push here, but at the same time, we can see A007 up top with Burmese goes here, just going in for the split push again. But at the same, as of now, Burmese goes, kids in one. They're setting up shop here to try and pick go for a pickoff. Same goes for Sunspark, which they spotted out the rotation. JP, they see it, and Sunspark, they will disengage here. They know exactly where Burmese goes are right now. Yeah, and if you are Sunspark in this situation, the best case scenario is that no one dies until the Lord spawns. You need to fight Burmese Ghoul for that objective, and they do have the line to do so. We are still waiting for Reflexia to come online. We're still waiting for Fuzakin to be the Grog that he was and Burmese goes off of one punish was able to stall out Sunspark's effectiveness now four members will collapse on their top lane they're trying to buy time here but Fuzu can almost get divine judgment here but K001 is there no charge of this again but he's gonna oh. be super fast he baited out so much spells from Burmese goes and this is gonna be the opening for Sunspark to take this here too and also the bottom tower as well what a play there from Sunspark Fuzu again with the class but eventually he will fall Burmese goes then overextending as well here comes Selby from Xbox on the middle side Ray Luminum Blast blazing to wet and Sunspark will now dash 
Ice Ice will fall, they're going up the panda as well. Maybe it's a divine judgment. They found the claw. Now kids gonna go wild with the high up Pusa Esperanto for two though. Kel BJ, can he save the game? K A007 trying to get away. The kid as well escaping with that chrono dash. Kel BJ on his team. Oh! Oh! They found the Harif! Sunspops, they saved the game! QBJ is back online. He managed to go for the defense here. 8007 fighting against Ratio. He has a Virga Hama. Can he go for the Baba? You're gonna find it. Nice side seven. Oh no! And Shadow Kill! Got it over there! But zero, seven! What a play! QBJ, what in the world was that? You shouldn't be near that x ball. Big mistake for Sunspop. They saved the game and then I just threw it away. Burmese goes. They have all five members online. They can go for this Lord. Sunsprout, they need a miracle. Maybe more than that. Fuzakan trying to buy time once again from the side of Sunspark. A007 on that Hayabusa. Level 14. He's gonna press his advantage here. Look at this. He's not afraid. He's gonna go a little bit aggressive. And Sunspark, they have to back up. The Divine Judgment catches on the Rufflesha. And they won't take it. Furries goes. They're doing it. They take the tags. Now, the Lord still up for grabs. Blade armor finally up available on the high loss here. But like I said, they are gonna respect this here. This economy is still 50-50 coming from both sides. Slowly but surely, Sunspox online timing is gonna overcome here. They need to close the gap on this XP curve against this Hayabusa coming from Burmese Ghouls. Yeah, Sunspox again now. Second time Burmese Ghouls working on that lore, but this time Sunspots, they're not gonna make it in time. Fuzakin is there as a power nature. Burmese Ghouls, they pull up the lore. Arrival is coming in from Teresla as well. Fuzakin control his body. Blaze the way comes in. Can he find a kill? The penalty zone from Panda! And now Lazarus Andy comes in from Rezo. Got life on Hayabusa. And Burmese Ghouls is already two. Kid going crazy. Ace is still alive. Double kill for the kid. It's gonna be the fall from Sunspot down. Triple kill for Harem. Burmese Ghouls find that fight. This might be the fight that Myanmar will push throughout the lower bracket. My oh my, it all comes down to QBJ to defend against the slot pusher. Burmese goals, they are 16 8. They're thinking about closing the game, but now QBJ, he needs to take out Ice Ice, but the high on snow is there. QBJ, he's almost getting bursted out, and now Burmese goals, they have the answer towards the Esmeralda. Here comes Kid 001, the new kid in the block. Burmese goals, they're thinking about closing this game now. Kid 001. Might not have the age of Kill VJ, but he showed that his youth shine, shine in this game. 6, 2, and 7 on this Harry. Absolutely amazing performance. Sansba, they messed up once, they messed up twice. Burmese goes with the Lord. They're gonna push down that uh, that top lane with that Lord. You look at this replay brought to you by U Mobile. Yeah, look at this here. The recap. Who's again was caught off guard. Same goes for the cloud as well. You can see they were dragged all the way back here from the side of a red seal. And when he tried to disengage, he pretty much couldn't do anything just because of how powerful the divine judgment brought into the table. But ladies and gentlemen, here we are going back into the live action because the turtle, uh, the the lord is going to be pushing up the top side. And you can see Sanzma. How will they defend against this here? The split push coming from Burmese goes. Sanzma. They're trying their best to defend against this. What can they do? Shadow Mask being suspended here as well. QBJ, they will focus down the bottom side. Can they kill A007? Oh yes, no. he wants to, but no, they don't get it. Opens up the map. The top side, getting time here from Burmese Ghost. How we do this? Lumina Blast. And Burmese Ghost, they need to go for the final push, but last insanity for Renzo goes right in. No Lumina Blast. They do find one, but Immortality will give Burmese Ghost a second life. Sanspa, this is the fight for their life. They find Renzo, they put Burmese Ghost back. Fusa can defend the top side, but here comes the Shadow Kill of the higher Fusa. A007. Look at Kid now, he's insane! Mega kill! Who's the kid knocks him out? Maybe goes to disengage. Guess out. Now, yet. this Harry, a bit oh, okay. they flicker in. They need the Harry there. Yeah. They will kill him off. Sunspark, they hold no. it. Double kill for kill VJ. Burmese goes. They're not gonna end this right now. They managed to defend somehow your kill VJ says, you may be the new kid in the block, but I'm the real kid. He's gonna try and defend against from the side of Sunspark. They lose all the outer inhibitors from the side of Sunspark, but Burmese goes. They're not giving up yet. You can see Sunspark, they want to get more. 8007. They can't heal him off yet. No. Oh, oh, the block. What a wall. Guys, you're in trouble. Well, he can finish off, but nope. No follow up here at Sunspark. Don't exactly want to overextend their fight now. Sunspark have three massive lanes to defend against. Burmese Ghoul will now always have the control on this minion wave. 
the next Lord will be up in 80 seconds. Sunspot, they gave out the first Lord. They need the second one to have a chance to stay alive. Oh no, how will they do this year? But at the side, Sunspark, they're going for the triple wooden mask strat here to try and build out the economy. That's the reason why Sunspark is trying to build here. They know they're losing in the economy game, and Burmese goes, they're like a approximately 8k advantage, and they have to play Snowball. Oh, oh my god, A007 with the cheeky size, and here he goes. Sunspark trying to catch up Ice Ice. They need to find out Ice Ice, the glorious pathway will be able to get away. Burmese goes. They're not gonna take. They're not gonna take it fast. They make it slow. They get the disengage. They need the medium wave to come in, and that is where they pull the trigger for that final push. Yep. They have to take things a little bit slow here. Sunspot. They have to drag it to, uh, towards overtime. This is where JP is gonna come up online. And Burnley's goes. They know this. They have to close this game. They can only go for a couple of pickoffs here. But Sunspot, slowly but surely, they're getting bigger. You can see the aggressions coming from Burmese goals and Sunspark, they're trying their best to defend against this year. The buff needs to be secured from Sunspark as Burmese goals, they know this is happening. They're trying to contest this against Sunspark as of now. How will it go down? Burmese goals, they might want to go for the collapse. 8007, isolated from the rest of his team. Lord, God Barrett does block out Burmese goals, but Lord, coming up in uh, as right now Burmese goes they're gonna take the fight and the last. on top Panda gets called out Sunspot they go for the collapse the flesh is there where is the Divine Jasper flicker in Divine Jasper they found JP JP is down no claws he is out of the building Burmese goes is this it is this the fight that Myanmar will take it to the end it's not over because why kill BJ he's super strong they get the Xbox but here it goes kill BJ they take one they take two he takes him down and oh Sunspot what a comeback! And look at it! The hardest! Oh, no. A challenge him! Second he wants to go to the middle, but you beat him! He has the bump, but he goes for the bigger! But he eventually can't! Zero, zero, one! It's a one! The clutch for where he goes! This is it! Myanmar, they have done it! Sunspots, the sun will fall! The sun will set! Myanmar, stay alive! They lock in top five! Where he goes! Won't take two, one against Sunspark! Will they be able to keep up the momentum? And ladies and gentlemen here, you can see the handshakes coming in. The victors will be Burmese goals. And unfortunately to say, this will be the end of the ride here for Sunspot. Yeah, Sunspot, Philippines, the last hope of the Philippines. They will bow out of M1. But they did pull up an amazing fight. Kill VJ show has a lot more years to go. But so what? I have the higher boost which you need to deal with and because of that they were able to reset that fight from the side of QVJ. And that's the downside about Esmeralda. No buffs, Esmeralda can't do much.